a good day, you know, coming off the second scrimmage. You really challenged the guys yesterday about the, you know, what we wanted your practice to look like, you know, the, the urgency, the competitiveness. We tried to script it to create more uh, competitive situations. You know, got some uh, uh, a little bit of serious work there at the end, just forcing forcing guys to continue to, have to you know, take ownership of down landmarks on the field, uh, your situation of the game. Got some, some overtime uh, situations put in. Just continuing to, to see these guys grow in their knowledge and uh, you know overall uh, you know, understanding of, of what to expect and uh, you know just continuing to work on the fundamentals and details and being able to execute uh, you know at a higher level. But uh, you know, I've been blessed with the with the, uh, with the workload. I thought you know, today you guys you know, you did explosive plays on both sides of the ball. Um, you, know, you felt you felt the speed. I thought guys came out and worked at a high level. So it was a, it was a good, good practice. Run game and those team situations seem to be pretty crisp. Yeah, it's uh, you get better. You know, it's one of those things that you just uh, you know as you as you're working you know different schemes, you know different looks. Uh, you're trying to trying to make sure that it, it does come down to you know, the details and fundamentals. Are you, are you doing a good job of your landmarks, whether it's O line, tight ends, receivers. Um, you know, obviously backs, tracks. Uh, you know, things. You know, different elements. I thought our quarterback's management of the run game has uh, been good. You know, much better, and uh, you know they, the way that they were kind of taking control of that, understanding checks, understanding, uh, understanding hey. different looks that uh, you know, what, we, what we like to Tell see, James to, you know, different ways to be able to uh, to mix it. Uh, but I thought it was guys did well. Way, just tell him to check his phone. After watching film, was he as good as you thought he was after the scrimmage, and did he carry over? Carry over? Yeah, you know, I thought uh, I thought he had a really good scrimmage. Uh, you know, uh, and I thought today he you know, saw some really good things. Excited, and I thought Brock. You know, you know, it's 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 fun to see the you know, him growing up into you know this second year and just where he's where he's at. Um, you know, uh, it's just that that steady progress and steady uh, growth. Um, I thought both those guys did some really good things today too. Ja'Kai made some splash plays today, and you kind of sometimes can forget about his impact. We well, can, no, but I, I know mean, you guys. That was know. a challenge. I mean, he was one that got you know, challenged this last few days, and you know, in the, in the scrimmage, he made a couple of good plays. Um, you know, that we need him to step up and make, and you know, then today I, I thought we felt it. And, you know, I mean, there's been a few days we haven't in this uh, in the spring ball, and that's that was uh, well received. And you know, I guess uh, the point the point got across because he, he was definitely really good. Today. Brock had a really big run. I don't know if you could. I don't want to give everything away, but like, was that something he should be? Was dialed up specifically for him to keep, or was that him playing good football and interpreting things well? Yeah, interpreting. He was a great interpreter there. His athleticism plays. He went over. He, you know, so I mean, he went over 20 miles per hour on that run. So I mean, it was speed, athleticism, like you. That's where you could see the strength. You know, I mean, that's something we tend to forget. You know, guys, um, as they go through the process of their. Uh, you know, career, you know, you see them get stronger, you see the agility improve, that's the confidence movements. But yeah, no, he was he was flying. In the scrimmage, obviously we know you've got a lot of veteran offensive line, but you've got some young guys trying to make themselves work in some cases. Did any of those guys stand out when you want to throw in the spring? Yeah, yeah, I'm a, well I'm an older guy that I think has had a hell of a spring that I really I want to yeah is uh Bryson Essence. Like, I, I think he's having the he's playing the best football he's played since he's been here. Um, I'm proud of him and you know he's He's really worked hard. Uh, you know, he's playing faster, playing more confident. And, I mean, going back and watch, I thought he did a really nice job. I'm seeing you know, Jalen Early, uh, Lucas Simmons, uh, you know, Andre Otto. I mean, those guys are doing they're doing a good job. You know, it's 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 a, you know, good to see that growth. I mean, even with the newcomers that have joined in, uh, those guys are really coming along. But um, I'm excited about that group. I think we got a lot of talented guys that uh, have an opportunity and uh, just continue to compete. DJ's kind of improved it the last few times just to him playing so much football and knowing when to when to turn it on or just him being now more well, I just think it's reps. I mean like you, so you go in and you learn I mean he's learned three different languages in whatever I guess the last three years. And you know everything's got there will be times where that helps the process just to, because of experience. Uh, but it's still you know we, we do things a certain way and a certain degree, certain timing, certain you know elements that uh, Get to the offense that you know, I thought would be a really good fit for him, and just as you see him building confidence in that, it's, it's exciting. It's exciting to, to see the uh, his growth. Uh, 
you know, I think his consistency is something I've been pleased with the last few days. Like, you know, you're eliminating the, the, the uncertainty at times. Um, and it's only going to continue to improve as, as we uh, you know, move closer move to the end of spring ball, but then also as we get you know, closer to, to fall camp. Thank you guys.